Hallo guys, welcome back, welcome to my channel Nihon Kara Konnichiwa, herzlich willkommen. Yo guys, update on SoFi, SoFi Technologies, um, I made already here several videos on my channel about this stock. If we are new to this channel here guys, then welcome. I will give you here the prediction to the up and downside here for SoFi based on the chart guys and based on my experience as a trader. This is not a financial advice guys. Yeah, guys, I mean, when we start here with SoFi, I will enable the drawings here, but when we just start here with the more or less plain chart, then you can see it seems that like something like a bottom is in for SoFi here. So we have here a very, very strong support at $4.87. We have some bearish signals in the chart that we could see some downside, but just when we have here a first sight on the very young chart, this company starts trading here in 2020, had an all-time high at $28. So we are far away from this all-time high, guys, waiting here at $7.45. But we can see that we have some increased volume here also because of the illusion that SoFi did. But it still looks very stable and it's a popular stock. A lot of people are invested here and hope for, yeah, to make some profits here, guys. In my opinion, we cannot expect here a big short squeeze like in one day or one week. We have some spikes, you can see, when the stock started trading here at $10, then we had here a very, very nice pop. We are here in the weekly chart, guys, so one candle is one week. So it took some time here to lift off, but we had here a very nice squeeze at 181%, and then you can see we come down and boom. Then the sell-off kicked in, what I think was caused by the delusion. They need to get some money here. But as I said, since we traded here at $4, 24 cents it is possible that something like a bottom is in when we focus now here on the indicators on the very few indicators which i show here in this chart then we can see that the ema lines here are still in control we are fighting here to find support on these ema lines normally what you want to see is something like that that the stock gains momentum a lot of buying pressure here goes over the ema lines retest them as a support and starts to go higher here you can see that we accumulating still we have here a very, very strong resistance in the chart, guys, and this is what we have to yeah, respect. Yeah, this is not, uh, I don't want to kill your hope or something like that. I think, I think we have really, really big potential here to see higher prices in the next weeks and months. But the main price resistance which we have was more or less here. The initial trading price here at $10.13. You can see when I enable now the drawing. Sorry, it looks a little bit messed up. I will show you how this works here. Then you can see the blue line is our resistance level guys we tried here already a few times to break out of this line here after the sell-off which we had here that was here in uh, february 2022 we had here one or two retests already here to go back over this price area of ten dollar and you can see we got rejected here once twice as i said these are weekly candles here and then the huge sell-off began and that was the the momentum where we built our yeah bottom here for sofa the potential bottom I made a video already here one week ago or two weeks ago where I said I want to load up some shares here as soon as we come back here in this blue box and that <laughs> was perfectly guys when I switch here now to the daily chart. If you know how to read charts then you yeah then you also know where are the potential so-called liquidity zones where the buyers waited. You can see my previous videos I never change or adjust my charts it's every time I leave them and show always the same chart here in the video guys and you can see that was almost here perfectly on the dot exactly here where I draw this liquidity zone was the bottom for now guys I mean of course we can still go lower we have some hidden hints here in the chart I will show you this in a second but for now you can see when I made the video that was on that day here where I said I expect here something to be a, uh, to have a reversal here in this box guys and you can see if we just focus not on the lowest price here on the bottom of this box we had here a total price run up of 10 percent yeah <laughs> nothing special guys i mean 10 percent is maybe maybe is good when you are not used um, to trading or not don't know how to trade in my opinion this is a little bit boring we had here this movement was necessary to do because we had here in the four hours chart when i remember right let me check that for you guys no, that was the daily chart. Dup, dup, dup. Yeah, it's not visible anymore. We had here an open gap. This gap is closed. That's why I draw that here in the chart so we can delete this line here. Not necessary anymore. It's already closed. But there was an open gap in the chart where why I said we have to come back and close this gap here. And the, <laughs> the problem is, guys, as I said, 10%, you know, is, is of course not bad, but it's also not too much here. And yeah, I want to see here some 
fast and quick squeezes in the market like this here we had this squeeze here 197 percent in one day or this one here 152 percent in one day here was the day when i made the video on that ticker here and then two days later we had the squeeze so this is normally what i do here on this channel if you don't know that yet guys i have here a membership on my channel the so-called elite circle membership where i show these kind of short squeeze stocks and yeah i try to help people here to get better on trading it's not my goal here to make people rich this is not my responsibility you are responsible for your own trades but i can just show you some very potential squeezing tickers here like this one where i yeah know i mean i made this video on sunday and on monday one day later we had this 197 percent squeeze i always talk about the stocks before they squeeze sometimes i have a very good timing sometimes it takes two weeks yeah and i have a bad timing but you know sooner or later those stocks squeeze because they always follow here some trading rules and this is the purpose you guys on my channel to educate here on these trading rules i just want to give you one quick example so uh, when you ask which tickers uh, i'm talking about of course i cannot show you these tickers here in this video but i always upload here this uh, so-called hot stocks here i have a lot of stocks for members only but these stocks here guys i have my own stock program which are reporting searching and reporting me these stocks then I make chart analysis and when I think they have squeeze potential and they have a good timing for a squeeze to buy in, then I present them here for my Elite Circle members, guys. And just one very quick example here. Uh, one feedback here, one email feedback from one of my Elite Circle members. He, yeah, uh, sadly he lost $22,000 uh, by trading AMC, yeah, by holding back, holding AMC. If you know what AMC is doing right now, I think it's possible to see here a new all-time low, but that's not the story right now. So you can see he lost $22,000 because he was over-invested in AMC. Then he started here to join the circle. This is the Elite Circle membership. And then less than two months ago, he made $9,000 in profits. You can pause the video, read by yourself what he's writing here, guys. Yeah, and that is, you know, this is, as I said, I cannot promise nothing here. Uh, nothing is guaranteed in trading, but if you want to see those stocks, guys, you can click here in the video description. There is the link to my memberships or just go here on the main page on my channel and uh, join here the Elite Circle membership. This is uh, the membership where you see these hot, hot, hot stocks or hidden short squeeze stocks. And of course, I show you a lot of short squeeze indicators, how to draw these charts here with the right indicators by yourself and spot entries and exits for short squeeze plays guys so now back to SoFi. when we now check here the chart looks a little bit messed up we still have here a potential guys to break out to the downside it is still possible technically why is that possible because we still have some open business here in the chart and what i mean with open business guys we have still two down gaps here at six dollar and five cents and five dollar and 48 cents and normally guys especially when you have a stock which has a high short interest SoFi guy is a stock with a high short interest. We have here 16.9% short interest. So 154 million shares are short. So the short sellers are not believe in this company or at least not don't believe that this actual price here is worth it for the stock. That's why the short interest is quite high. Everything here until three to 5% is normal, but here it's quite high guys. And you can see that they have also here uh, two, more than 2 million shares available to short the stock here every day and they take them guys yeah so yeah the short sellers are serious here and what i want to show you is that they covered already here some of the shares so we had here one peak and i think that was the all-time high for so far 144 million let me check that yes that was the all-time high so the all-time high when we focus here on the short interest was 158 million shares that was the peak 17.36 percent of the float the float is right now 911 million shares and you can see they covered 4 million shares here just in february but since then nothing changed here they didn't load up any shares but also don't cover because i think guys here in this you know in this trading range where we are right now here is a potential yeah breakout zone and support zone that's why i draw this blue box here and this is confirmed as a support but we are still trading here below these ema lines so these white yellow purple ema line here is a resistance guys and the next temporary resistance level which we have is waiting here at eight dollar twenty two we have also open gaps to the upside so there is a good chance that we will close these gaps here as well eight dollar fifty seven and here nine dollar fifty three guys we have open gaps to the upside but unfortunately also everything here everything here in this box eight dollar sixty to ten dollar eighty six guys here this red box in the background is the so-called bearish liquidity zone the bears waiting here the short sellers the market makers they don't want 
that Sophie goes over these price levels. That's why it's very possible that we come back here and close these open gaps. But we have to see a price over $10, guys, to talk about here a potential yeah, uptrend or squeeze. I want to show you here one different chart. By the way, guys, everything here, what you see, these creepy lines, you can pause the video and just try to draw that by yourself. So I use always here trading view. Uh, when I show here these charts, guys, this is everything based on trading view. So if you also want to try, try to draw these charts here by yourself, you can, of course, use trading view. I have a link here in the video description. When you click this link, you get a $15 discount, guys, on your trading view account. The link is in the description below. And when you uh, yeah, want to ask which subscription is good here for TradingView, this is this link in the description, then I always recommend the plus subscription, guys. The essential is very limited. You have very limited access to indicators. But when you choose the plus subscription, you have a lot of indicators available. And this is for, I think, for beginners and advanced traders. This is the way to go, guys, by using this link. Uh, when you just click this automatically, a $15 discount is calculated when you check out. So no problem here, guys. Try to save some money. And yeah, then you can, of course, uh, pause the video here and try to draw the lines by yourself. Yeah, but this, guys, is the, you know, when we, when we concentrate here on the um, trading pattern for SoFi, then you can see since we have this bottom here, we have here something like an, yeah, leg up or even a gap up because we have open gaps here in the chart but since then since here was some potential bottom at four dollar 43 cents here this candle we have here a very beautiful leg up or gap up you can call it how you want and since then we are trading here in the so-called bull flag guys so normally this is uh, something like an um, like a bearish trend uh, also not a bear channel but a bearish trend channel but you can see that we still holding here these price levels and that's why I would call this a bull flag guys so when we just focus here on trading uh, einmal eins how to say that trading basics then you can see this is the typical pattern of a bull flag where we normally break out to the upside the only thing which is not good is that we have the open gaps here to the downside as i said we don't need to close them now we can close them a few years later even but this is something which i don't like if i could wish something i want to see that the price is coming down closing these gaps here and then that we leave the trend channel here to the upside guys because this is in my opinion here a very beautiful bull flag pattern and that could mean we see a breakout incoming for SoFi but keep that in mind if the breakout should happen so as I said we can also use that here in this chart this guys is the make it or break it price level for now guys here are the short sellers waiting here in this price range because you can see we have a lot of rejections here one, two, three, four, five, six, you know, but so many attempts to break out. And as long as we don't build lower lows, we are here still in an uh, uptrend for SoFi. And then, guys, when we close a candle here, a weekly candle over $10.12 here in this area, then, guys, it could get really, really crispy because we have no real resistance waiting here in the chart. Here is one small resistance at $12.94 even thir almost $13 here is a small resistance waiting, not too strong in my opinion. But then guys, we have here nothing waiting until yeah $15. So that would be a 50% price increase here as soon as we come over this price level here. In my opinion, as I said, this is not a financial advice, but this is based on the chart guys. Yeah, 50% potential we have here, even a little bit more to go higher when we can see a price over $10.50 guys. Yeah, very interesting stock. As I said, it's a little bit boring because we don't have that much squeeze potential. If you cannot wait, guys, you can, of course, join in here the Elite Circle membership. Then you see here the really, really yeah, nice and spicy hot stocks. As I said, there is no guarantee in the market, but we had a lot of squeezes in the past weeks. And besides that, I also start now Patreon. I just built up my, my page here. It's a little bit creepy, but I have here also a short, uh, short squeeze a black belt club or, you know, where I really um, present tickers which have squeeze potential. And this is for, you know, a, a quick entry and exit, guys. So, you know, here in the Elite Circle membership, I give a lot of details and there is it more about how to trade the stocks and, you know, how to make your own uh, yeah, trading experience and uh, yeah, the experience and knowledge to increase that. And here is just about trading signals, though I don't go do that much in detail here. But you can also see some nice tickers here which have squeeze potential. Or if you want to see AMC and GameStop updates, you can, of course, also join in here on the Patreon. But this is everything also part here of the Elite Circle membership where you see these hot stocks as well, guys. Okay, guys, that was my quick update here on SoFi. I wish you great success with your trades. 
Thank you for watching this video, guys. Good luck here with this ticker. And if you want to see any other tickers, guys, where you need a chart analysis, as I said, just join in the Elite Circle membership. I also do chart analysis on request. Guys, good luck and see you in the next video. Arigatou gozaimasu. Vielen Dank. Viel Erfolg. Alles Gute und bis bald. Take care. Bye-bye, guys.